The shallow shore is a temperate zone from the shoreline to 30 feet. It is rich in life and is where juvenile fish seek protection from larger predators. Bonaire, Netherlands Antilles, provides a prime example of shallow shore environment. Bonaire is an extinct volcanic island and is a special protectorate of the Netherlands. Approximately one half of the population is transplants from this European country. The official currency is the US dollar and multiple languages are widely spoken including English, Dutch, Spanish, and Papiamento. Even the language of the island is unique. Papiamento is spoken only on three islands in the world including Bonaire and its two sister islands of Curaçao and Aruba. The island had a small full-time population of approximately 3,000 people until the 1960s. Even today, the island has a full-time population of only 14,000. There is still not a stoplight on the island and takes us back to a time that has long been forgotten except in the smallest towns in modern industrialized countries. A set of circumstances and geological forces came together by chance to create this enchanted island with its world-renowned coral reef ecosystem and amazing sea life. Bonaire has very few sandy beaches and a rocky shoreline, mostly comprised of coral. Because it is a desert island, there is little or no farming and thus no fertilizer pollutant runoff into the ocean that is a reef killer. The historically small population resulted in no sewage being pumped into the surrounding waters and the abundant coral reef ecosystem that surrounds the entire island. The island is located in the southernmost region of the Caribbean and outside of the typical hurricane path. There has not been a direct hit to the island in over 400 years, allowing the reefs to flourish and grow like no other location in the Caribbean. And most importantly, the governments of Bonaire and the Netherlands and their citizens have recognized the truly unique geological makeup of Bonaire and have taken world-leading steps to implement conservation efforts and protocols to protect this natural wonder. Approximately 80,000 visitors come to the island each year with 75% of the foreign visitors coming to the island to scuba dive. The lucky few that had the opportunity to visit the island has historically been limited. Direct jet service has expanded in recent years as routes have been established by major airlines from Amsterdam, Atlanta, Houston, Miami, Charlotte, and LaGuardia airports. Puddle jumper service between Aruba and Curaçao to Bonaire is now in place. Long gone are the days when the islands could only be reached by boat. The permanent residents of the islands and the governments of Bonaire and the Netherlands have implemented reef protection protocols over the last 30 years to ensure the magical reefs of the island are protected. Bonaire has consistently been rated number one in shore diving, best value, macro sea life, coral reef healthiness, safest location to scuba dive and photography. The island's license plate reads, Diver's Paradise. The island is known for its diver's freedom with over 50 dive sites accessible from shore and 24 hour per day diving. There are additional 30 dive sites that are accessible by boat. In total, there are almost 90 marked dive sites on Bonaire.